Neuqua Valley has only won its own event once in the last eight years, but looks to return to the perch against a strong field including Wabonzi and St. Charles East. Off the blocks they go, the 200 yard free. Wabonzi Valley's Ayush Despande among the favorites, but has a pair of Wildcats in contention, including Connor Boyle. To the line and it's the Warrior Star Swimmer tapping in first with a 1.44 mark. Boyle second. Next we go to the 200 IM. Wabonzi's Jared Simpson and North Horse Chow facing some stiff competition in St. Charles North's William Meyer. Despite coming in with a seven second gap between he and the favorite, Simpson pulls off an upset. Not only winning, but finishing with a meet record 153.73 time. Now to the 53, Nikwa's Kyrie Chen comes in with the best qualifying time, but not by much over a tight field that includes Matias Samuel Kasten. To the pads, and it's Chen with the win by a shade over half a second. Kasten placing fourth. I mean, I'm definitely really happy about my results. Uh, I made a lot of improvements throughout the summer, and I'm glad I can bring that into the high school season. Look forward to a great season with the team. We've been doing a lot of good work and excited to see what we can do. Time for the 100 butterfly. There's Desh Pande again. North Chow also in the final heat. Coming around the last turn, Chow is leading the pack, looking to nab a win for his Huskies. And he gets it, a 50.65 mark, just shy of the meet record. One last race, the 100 backstroke. Nico with the lead after nine events, just a few left to go. With a blistering start and an even better kick, Wabonzi's Jared Simpson tops the field with a 52.48 time. Nikwa's Kyrie Chen second, Matias Michael Chen third. Despite the Warrior win, Wildcats take the meet by almost 100 points. Our top guys did really well. Uh, we won four individual events, which is awesome. Uh, we had some freshmen step up. Lucas Conrad scored 30 individual points, which is really awesome. Um, and we also, uh, we loaded those back relays at the end with a lot of young guys and uh, they really did their best. We came up a little bit short. We really wanted to get second, but uh, they still did really well.